wake up. So it's 4.42 in the morning. This is usually when my day begins. This is what my... I've had this idea to live like Casey Neistat for seven days for quite some time now. To me, it's really fascinating trying to get into the brains of people that are really successful and have done amazing things and omen. Well, I'm going to take it as an omen, as a sign, because... So, this year has been a very crazy... I really like vlogging, which surprises me. I thought I'd do a, a video here or there. I actually enjoy it. So... I just wasn't sure if I wanted to do it daily. I think this live like Casey challenge is the perfect way to start that. First day of me trying to be up earlier, so I woke up at five. Second day was a little harder than the first. We're getting not too bad to get up at five. Not too bad. Easy morning this morning, huh, buddy? Huh. Day six. The waking up part's not hard, which is surprising to me. It's 11 o'clock. Didn't see me at five o'clock because I didn't get up at five o'clock. Time to get up. Get ready for school. Time to get up, Bell Bell. Get ready for school. Goosey goosey, time for school. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. It clock taking Gracie to work or to school. Cause Ellie doesn't feel good and Presley already went at seven. So it's Monday. And that's band aid. Part of the schedule I'm changing is Casey runs a lot. Like, what's he say, like 10 miles in the morning. I am so far out of shape, I can't run 10 miles. Whew, that's done. A little slower than I'd like. <clears throat> Got it done. Today by far the best day. 10 o'clock, time to work. got the girls, obviously, from school. <laughs> girls are done with homework. Homework's done. Now family time. That's where we're getting our present. This is day seven of the Live Like Casey challenge. And well, I'd say I failed because I didn't work out twice a day. I didn't do some of the stuff he does, but I also am not looking to do this for one week only. I'm looking to more make this a permanent change. So I figure if I, if I actually make the change long-term, and don't and don't shock my system as far as like a, I only have to do this for a week, so let's let's put up with it for a week. If I, five o'clock thing, I, I got down. 
That's the, honestly, that was probably the hardest one for me. Now I can work on the exercise. That being said, I did exercise. Overall, it does let you see why Casey's so successful. Like just the amount of time he puts aside for everything. Like the way he's balanced his life is pretty amazing. Like I've been looking for a way to balance work and home life. I am, I'm usually when I'm trying it too heavy on one or the other. So I feel like this is a really good mix. It's working, so we're gonna keep it going and see what happens. A couple things with the schedule. You see at the end I said time with Val. I failed at that miserably. I started working and wouldn't go hang out with her as much. So we're gonna fix that. Like I said, this wasn't a one week challenge. This was a very long term idea. Um, I was really good at going to bed at 11.30. Obviously, it's not something you really film. It's horrible about the second workout. I actually worked through it. I think that'll change, for sure. The end of next week, I go to a rally. So there'll be a lot of car stuff coming up. Keep an eye out.